if I was in a, so I will say this guys, while we might bounce right here, we're kind of in that oversold territory. If I'm in puts and they're green, I would just try my best to put my stop in the green and see if you can't hold out. There's going to be that quick urge to just lock it in right at the bell and you'll lock in the money. You can't count it until it's in your hands. So there's some perks to that. It's kind of hard to be red when you lock it in, uh, despite back holding other red trades, you know. But if you could put your stop in the green, give it some proper wiggle room. If if you really want to make some money on, on any play in general, if you have the ability to put your stop in the green and let the trend take off, that's where the home runs come into place. Because imagine you were, uh, let's say you bought a put right here, and the next morning you were up and you locked it in right here versus you put your stop in the green. Yeah, you only would have made a couple bucks if it tagged out. You would have made a few more had you just took took profit. But look what you would have been in had you just risked that couple bucks to let that play out. And, and right now, we're kind of at that oversold territory, but also say the words and you're going to spook a lot of people right out of their position and we could catch a meltdown. I don't really want to do any like fear mongering, but I, I got to say it's, it's very much on the table at these levels.